I was uh, going through my uh, closet in the spare bedroom today and I found these old wire hangers. I used to use these to hang up uh, coats. I don't use them anymore. I only use plastic or the rubber coated. And I thought, instead of throwing these away, there's got to be something I can do with them. I've came up with two ideals for them and I hope you guys like this. On the ones with the paper, you just pop out the ugh, pop out the ends of them. Then, and uh, what I do is go right here and I clip them. Then I take and I try to straighten it up as much as I can where the bend is. Alright, then I bend one back. Make you a, a little, make you a little loop out of them. You might want to close it in a little better. And you got your hook on this end where it come out of the paper. Close this up as much as you can. All right. You want to do your other one. Loop it back. And then try to straighten it up. Try to close these loops as tight as you can. You won't get them to close all the way. But anyway, you want to make this as straight as you can make it. Then I took uh, one and I clipped one side and I left the hanger part and I closed it up just a little. And I went down to the next corner without cutting any of this. Now, you want to make sure that they will slide over your next hook down, your next hook down. All right, let me take these. And I'll take you in here in a second. This is what it should look like. And you can do as many of these as you'd like. Do as many of them as you want. You can also use a, uh, uh, just a regular wire hanger, just cut at the corner and then cut right here to make your loop. But anyway, I decided to go with this for now, but I'll be right back. So now... We are in my dining room, and I'm going to hang the one with the big hook part on it, the top part. Hang it over the plant hanger hook. And then you want to start putting all of them, hooking all of your hooks on there, all the way down. Sorry I have to do it like this because i got to hold it still with the other hand. It doesn't matter which way they're... It doesn't matter which way they're pointed. Just keep hooking them together like that. Now, this is going to be good for... If you got a bunch of small plants that are taking up a lot of room, go along. And hang them all on here. And this is why you want to stagger them so the plants aren't right on top of each other. This one's a little shorter. And it makes a great little plant hanger for smaller plants. And it helps save up space on cabinets or wherever you're sitting them. Okay, now let's take the 
plants off. So now I can hang all my small plants in one spot without having to worry about taking up a whole bunch of room on top of counters and stuff. Now, the second thing that I use them for is if you have one of those really tall closets that have the bar way up here and hangs way down, there's no shelving or anything under them, the best thing to do with that is hang these in your closet and then go through and hang your t-shirts or shirts, whatever, on there. And you're saving so much room in that closet. There, are, It's only about as thick as a regular t-shirt. Doesn't take any up any more room uh, width-wise. And you got a lot more places to hang. And it's a lot better than that... Uh, cheap plastic ones that they sell now that you hang in your closet to do this with. These will last a heck of a lot longer, a lot cheaper. If you have wire hangers, it's not going to cost you anything. Get a pair of wire cutters and go to town. I, uh, If you don't have wire hangers and you have these wire hangers with the rubber coating on them, you can use those also. But don't throw those hangers away. I mean, through my life, I've seen ha wire hangers from the 50s, 60s. They're still there. They last forever. I find them in the yard and everywhere, and I just hate them. And once I quit using them, I didn't want to throw them away. So this is what I come up with to use them for. All right, guys. I'm going to get up here and take these shirts down and, and hang the plants back up. You guys have a great day.